Hi, this is Dan, and I'm here with Ronald's play of Super Auto Pets. So, what I'm thinking here, uh, so I went back to uh, pack two here, is that I've got sort of like a reverse like Wobegon effect going on where I think every pet is below average, so I don't want to take any of them. So I'm going to try to be a little bit more thoughtful about how I do this and kind of walk through some of the pros and cons. So the iguana I like, it's a, it's a good unit, so let's just start with that. We know that the strawberry also has a lot of potential, so let's freeze that. Now we don't want to take it yet because we probably want to have three pets in the first round. Okay, so the pill bug, the pro is you get some buffs, but you have to wait a while. And it's only a 2-2 this round. The duckling, it gives a nice buff to the leftmost pet, has kind of terrible stats. Um, and also, if you like get buffs on it, then you don't want to sell it. So a, an animal with a sell trigger is feels a little dangerous, but because I normally don't take it, and I normally lose. Let's take it. You know, let's put some of the stanza strats here. Um, all right, well, and then we'll freeze this one and take the seahorse because the seahorse iguana combo is, is just better. All right, and then we'll see how this goes. Uh, we can be the confused buddy duddies because that's going to describe. I'm playing here. This is all acknowledged that my previous strategies have just not been working so well, so I'm trying to uh, be a little bit intentional about uh, rethinking things. All right, well, we tied. That's uh, better than losing. All right, so got a duckling. Cockroach has good HP, um, but it doesn't scale. It's sort of like a great unit for one round, which I don't think we want. You know, the duckling is also a bit of, bit of a problem. Okay. So we could get a hummingbird and a strawberry, and that's a strong early game play. Uh, we could also get a pill bug, which is about to go off. Hmm. There are two of them. Let's go, Strawberry. And we'll just abandon the pill bug on this round. Okay, well, I think this is going to be good for us. So they must have been trying to build to something, but they did not really get there. Okay, so of these, the frog is interesting, but rarely works out for us. Now, it would have better stats if we sold the duckling to give it better stats. Um... The problem is the swap is always strange. So let's be a little bit older here. And the problem with the duckling is always that I'm reluctant to sell it. So let's get a decent gear. Put the bird in front so it'll get the seahorse stats. Now, 
no, that's not going to be good because the frog will go before the hummingbird. Right. Well, whatever. Um, yeah. Okay. Salamander is great. So let's get one. Now we're just going to have to figure out what do we want to get rid of for the flex slot to make the salamander work. So you are a start of battle. Um, yeah, I think the iguana is good, but we can get rid of that. You guys aren't start of battle. So let's just keep rolling a little bit. You guys aren't start of battle, but I mean, we could get buffs on our strawberry unit. Which I think is still somewhat relevant. attack and get that's worth doing Except I forgot about the frog. Well, still, I mean, having a 310 back here is not terrible. Is a bit of a problem there. Okay, well, I think do that. Oh, I keep I forget when you when you bring it to level two, it's no longer a um, start of battle. All right, still I or think this is good. Okay. 
Yeah. Ty is better than nothing. Um. Yeah. So this is obviously good. And we can do this. So I think once we swap the stats on our salamander, uh, we're going to be in better shape. That skunk was a problem. I thought we were like, oh, this is going to be great. And then the skunk went out. Uh, yeah, Okay, well, I really like you because you're a start of battle and a permanent buff. Um, which means I probably want to end with you because I want to oh, keep you on the team. Or, you know, maybe we could get rid of the hummingbird. Well, let's do this for now. And then I think the time has come to swap you. We could also swap the salamander here. The uh, I was doing Costanza strats there too, of like thinking, well, I, I usually would be reluctant to um, to do that. And... All right. Yeah, because I always want to get that frog to level 3 so it does the permanent thing and then you don't have to get rid of it, but I think trying to make the cell work is probably better. Because now we've got a nice high HP seahorse right up there. And we still have our scaling salamander. And we got a victory. So that great. I should have done that slightly differently. Should have done like a buy sell, buy sell with probably the mouse. But I don't know, then we all lost the lock up. So let's just roll. Here's start of battle. And here's start of battle.
take a while there, but uh, salamander's bad in cleanup. differently because I'm going to want you at the end. Well, run you for a round and get your buff. It's pretty good, but really doesn't do anything on this particular squad. you, but you don't have the stats. Now, well, no, we don't have the frog anymore. Uh, yeah, I think now we are also start a battle. You just scale everybody except for you. So that would be giving up plus two plus one. Let's hold on to you and swap your stats. Oh no, scorpion. <laughs> yeah, the uh, scorpion totally destroys my team. It's a big problem. All right. to combine you. Well, no, they're not that bad once we get past that llama. Alright. Let's get well no, we don't want to get you a pepper, because you benefit now from the husky. Thank you. 
this. Okay, yeah, we still win though. It's tense, but we got there. We can't, I mean, you're only a plus four, plus two. So we can get rid of you uh, in favor of the Bullet Velocer after Stegosaurus is also really good. And this would be a plus 13, 13. So it might be time to get rid of both of you. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I think... Like, I like the pelican, but... I can't think of a reason to not do this. Um, except that maybe I should have done the crow there. too late. Honestly, I don't think we need this anymore. Because we're probably not going to be scaling you by buying start of battles, and your HP is already pretty good. And this... You're a tier 6, so... Why not? You're also a tier six. I guess we could think about this if there's nothing better. Oh, I totally forgot. <laughs> I just, uh, Deactivated my husky, basically. I mean, I guess that argues in favor of saying I can get rid of the husky. Take out this giant dog. Well, enough to tie. Alright. And now, like, the husky, basically, now the only thing it's doing is buffing the salamander. So let's. Um, just buff the salamander directly. Do that at least. And this is uh, the buffing salamander and the strawberry pet. And if we don't have to worry about the husky, we can also give a pepper to the salamander.
like a big rooster in the heck. Yikes. Oh, we tie again. I mean, a Stegosaurus Triceratops combo would be interesting if we can get you to level 2. So we sell you. Now I'm thinking to buy sell with the crow, but it's it's not enough. We don't have enough money. Probably move the well. I could have moved in the Stegosaurus anyway. Oh no, scorpion! At oh, least is a big scorpion. So, oh, and we've got uh, coconut armor. Awesome. Scorpion had me scared, but uh, our team was already prepared to deal with it. Alright, so we get rid of you. And we get your expensive chocolate. And we make you a level 2. And level 2, yeah. <laughs> Popcorn beats honey. Alright, well... I mean, I think I deviated from my plan a little bit, you know, partway through, where I just, you know, kind of went with my gut again, but uh, I did something right. <laughs> so, uh, I hope you enjoyed watching, and I hope you come back next time. Bye!